Hey guys, so back in the day, like a couple of years ago, there were two big Pokemon games. Pokemon Brick Bronze and Project Pokemon. Now, Pokemon Brick Bronze, we all know, changed into Lumion Legacy. And we haven't heard a lot about Project Pokemon, but that all stops today. Because a couple of days ago, they released a brand new game. To replace Project Pokemon. I like to introduce you to Doodle World. Here we are in Doodle World, and of course, we are going to create a brand new game file because we haven't played the game before. So here we go, and let's see how good it is. I, I've seen a bit of the art style, and it looks really, really nice. So apparently we have been forced by our mother to compete in the find the key contest. And to participate we actually need a doodle of our own. And we can get that at the lab right over here. But before we do that I want to check the menu out real quick see what it's all about. I see a lot of different stuff. Let me go through... Woohoo I can talk. Let me go through that really quick to see if I miss anything. That, that's worth mentioning. And with that, it's already time to pick our starter doodle. I'm pretty sure you can get the other ones through other methods. But let's see, we got Pupski, the Ice Dog. Vibe Ember, the Fire Snake. Tabled, the Electric Cat. And Scrappy, the Earth Monkey. So, hmm, I think I like the snake the most, but I feel like most people are gonna pick the snake. And since you probably can get all of them anyway, I think I kind of like Pipski. Even though I just said everybody's gonna take the snake, everybody is gonna take the dog. Anyway, I really like ice type, so let's pick the dog. And he's balanced, here we go. So we got the dog, and we instantly enter a battle... This is so classic. Classic Pokemon. Pro not Pokemon Pokemons. Classic Project Pokemon Battle. I love the art style. Okay, let's do a bite. And boom, there we go. Half damage. Here we go. He is flinched and couldn't move. So we will bite again. And boom, and he isn't down. I really want that thing that he has, actually. I think that's a really cool doodle. So let's bite him again. And boom. And he is down, he is down. I think they actually said that you will get compensated for your game passes from Project Pokemon. And I bought, I think, all of them. So, we need to see right after this battle and stuff if we got anything from that. I see that they even brought back the roulette from <laughs> Project Pokemon, which I'm a little bit iffy about, but it's still cool. I really like this thing though, and the cactus. Ooh, wait, we can reset three times. Okay, we're not gonna buy the roulette today, but let's just see what we can get. So we got some hidden traits here, uh, some more. So these are all the doodles that you can find in game. And as you can see, you can get the starters this way. So, whoa! Is this like a hidden trait shiny? Oh, it's too bad that we don't do rolls today because else I was gonna get this and the last one is just a hidden trait okay uh, let's actually jump more in the game but first game passes we're gonna buy every single game pass real quick the hidden trait game pass to get more hidden traits the misprint game pass to find more misprints and misprints are basically shinies and you will know I love myself some shinies. Double money token because of course we need double money. It's very important. Mythical trinkets to get all those mythical doodles and legendary doodles. There we go. And the magnifying glass to find some competitive doodles in the wild. We're gonna skip out on the extra animations yet because I don't think PvP is really big in this game yet. Of course for this video... We're also gonna get, um, let's see, we're gonna get a 3 hour 2 times experience boost and a 3 hour 2 times misprint boost. 
And I also saw this, which is really funny. You can change your starter in like a doodle skin. So I also want to get that uh, and see how that looks. So let's see, where do we equip that? I think here, stats, customize skin. Yes, and we can doodle-fy him. Yeah, so let's make him a doodle. There we go. Very nice, very cool. And let's change his color to pink too. There we go. Nice. Let's actually play the game now because, <laughs> wow. Oh, look at that. He walks behind me even with his skin. Ooh, I want to shine you into this game. So wait, if you find uh, a misprint or a shiny and you, can you equip this skin on them? I need to know. I need to know. But first, let's go to the first route. I love this. I, I saw this on Twitter and this is the coolest thing ever. You can see everything that's on the route. And when you catch everything on the route, you get rewards. In this case, you get like a cool title. So we definitely need to get that. But first, let's fight this trainer with our new doodle skin. I want to see what it looks like. So let's check it out. Here we go. And he's gonna send out a... I'm gonna send out Pupski. There he is, all doodly, and he's gonna send out Niblen. And I'm just gonna buy him because that's super effective. Boom, and one shot. Our first encounter ever is Rosebug. I love this thing. He looks so cute. He actually looks so cute. Let's see if we can not kill him with a snowball. Boom. Okay, he survived. And now we, I want to try and catch him and see if it updates on the board automatically. So let's go. Basic capsule. Boom. 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 And we got him. And he is added to the party. And that should mean that we got a task. So there are t and indeed, he is on the route board now. Progress, one of the three. And apparently there are tasks, which is really interesting. Kind of like Legends Arches, so that's really cool. So we found the second one, which is a Bordo, a really cute bird. So let's try to catch this for our scoreboard. And then we only need one more. Nice, nice, nice. That's two out of three. Wow, and the next encounter, there it is. We literally got all of them back to back. I hope I don't kill it. There we go. All we need to do is catch it. And we should get an awesome new title. So let's use the basic capsule. And uh, I already see the notification in the top right. Let's go. So as you can see, we got everything from route one. The progress is complete. And instead of the beginner title, which we have right now, we got the doodle beginner title. Yay, round of applause. Honestly, I feel like Pupski is really a speedrun strategy. He almost one-shots everything with super effective moves. But without further ado, we have reached Route 2. So let's take a look. And we got a cutscene with very epic music. A ninja runs into us. <coughs> oh, are we actually gonna battle? This is a really cool soundtrack. It's very loud though. But yes, we have a battle with the ninja. And she sends out, let's see, a kitchen, which, oh, that's a cool one. Ooh, I want to see the misprint of the, I'll, see, this is what I mean. We're super effective against everything. And he got one shot. Nice, nice. And as you can see on route two, we actually get a color as a reward. So there's two more things that we need to find here. And yeah, I, I think this is such a cool concept, such a cool game. I really enjoyed this is such a cool cool game like honestly the designs are amazing the, the sprite art is amazing everything about this is just amazing and I can't wait to get to the end game and hunt some misprints and some skins like all that kind of stuff I love that we will probably do a ton of streams about this game and find awesome stuff and be the best doodle master there's ever been Oh, here is somebody with that got the monkey. Oh, that's so cool, dude. Now, of course, I'm not gonna lie. I also tried this game out before on my alt. And uh, <laughs> I got very addicted to it. As you can see, 
<laughs> we got dirty and we played for four hours. And what did we do in that four hours? I want to show you guys because we found something amazing. Absolutely amazing. So, of course, on Artist Chan, obviously Artist Chan because it's a doodle game. And if we go into the PC, and there we go, we open it up. And yep, we found ourselves a reskin Rosebug. After chaining, there is actually chaining in this game. And you can get skins, shinies, misprints, tints more stars everything it's so fun and so cool so definitely in the next video we will be showing you how to get a skin shiny or a misprint it's gonna be epic it's gonna be fun and i hope you guys will be there anyway guys thank you all so much for watching if you like this video and want to see more doodle worlds please leave a like and subscribe and i will see you guys in the next video Bye bye